Look, it's been a weird week. So if I get a little aggro, it's not my fault, bitch. You understand me? Yeah, well, Fair warning. I woke up this morning. First of all, waking up this morning was more of like I sort of slept, but I didn't. Mm -hmm. And it's all been because a, a close friend of mine is in the slammer now. And he's clearly going to get killed. Big time. So yeah. that's a thing. You know, I worry about the guy, even though he's a scumbag. You got to worry. Yeah. So, so you know, whatever. No sleep. So I wake up in quotes and I'm like, all right, it's going to be a good day. And then I get a message from my friend and she's like, you'll never another believe. Friend. Yes, another friend. Yeah. Uh, a female friend that's not going to get stabbed in the face. Uh, she's like, you're never going to believe what I saw at the store. And I'm like, this is too early for this, but sure, what's up? And she goes, croc nuts. Damn, homie. Now, you know I hate me some truck nuts. <laughs> yeah, we made many vid. You hate Crocs, and deservedly so, I until you wear cheap yeah. Crocs. <laughs> but croc nuts? You're going to yeah. have to insert that there. I can't believe this is a thing. So that sucks. I'm already pissed at life itself. Mm -hmm. But then I get a message, you see? A message from a guy Another that message. had been actively avoiding me, even though I was like, yo, I got that paper for you. Give me what you got. Now, let me clarify. To add to the aggroness. Were you dealing on the side? Hold on, homie. I got that! <laughs> to add to the aggroness. Yeah, homie. I've been feeling a little aggressive towards you lately. I'm like, there's a guy that exists in my life. I've been doing shit, guys. I know. That's why I'm like, ah! I don't know how to explain it to the audience, but suffice it, to, suffice it to say, there's one fucking day out of the week where I'm like, all right, cool. And I didn't get that. So I was like, this sucks. I'm going to strangle this fuck. But despite that, I was like, all right, your birthday's coming up. I got to get him something, right? So I had a plan and it was a good plan, damn it. Damn it. Damn it. It was a damn good plan, but it was it was struck to the ground like a Spartan child. Mm -hmm. And I was like, that's that sucks. So I went with the alternative plan, which doesn't suck. I hope didn't suck. White Stripes album. Nah, it doesn't suck. It's pretty rad, guy. Hated it, is what you said. Nah, homie. But that still bugged me because of this plan, <laughs> this plan was going to be great. After this mm -hmm. plan saw fruition, I was like, how can he ever not be my slave? Damn, <laughs> this is gonna be you the ultimate slavery. This is the ultimate get. You know what I'm saying? It's horrible. So I was like, "Fuck, man, <laughs> I gotta, I gotta get this right." But it was not to be because the guy left me high and dry. Mm -hmm. And I was like, "Well, this, he literally vanished off the face of the planet." This guy. What item that was, I will not disclose, because what happened later actually trumps that item. So that item is literally feces. <laughs> now, okay, it's no good. It's crap. You should have never gotten it because compared to what I got, it's literal mounds of turds. Anyway, I was like, that that's a thing that happened. But but he should be happy with a insanely expensive album. Why are albums yeah, this expensive, dude, man? I gotta say, it's ridiculous. Can't come on, guy. 14 bucks max. This was some, this was something I was gonna get, but I was like, damn, the price on this is Yeah, price is ludicrous. But anyway. Yeah. Yesterday, before I went to quote unquote sleep. Somebody posted something in one of the groups that I frequent. Uh, a local group. So this was a feasible get. You know? One. Two. What they posted, I was like... <gasps> Three. The price they posted at, while definitely not money that I have access to, well, I did. But I was like, damn it. <laughs> that's my money. Uh, uh, as in, that's all my money. I was like, that price is undeniable. He's got to have... He's got to have done something wrong. He's a, a typo, something, right? So I contact the guy and I'm like, hey, do you still have this item at said price? Just yeah. to make sure. Make sure, yeah. And he's like, oh, actually, I'm holding it for someone. Uh, you know, if, if, if they bail out on me, it's yours. And I'm like, fuck, fuck. How are you holding it for someone? And you posted it at three in the morning at 3.15, I noticed it, and I was like, what's up with this item? But whatever. Holding it for something, fine. I'm like, all right, let me know. <sighs> so uh, when I wake up from my slum bear, 
I'm like, all right, already the crock nuts have pissed me off. I get online, I'm online, and I go check the this group just out of habit, and I see that he has reposted said item. Mm. And I'm like, oh, the guy must have billed on him yeah. in the morning. Same price? Same price. All right. I'm like, I said, I hit him up immediately. I says, look at here. What's up? Does this guy bail on you or what? Because I can be there in 30 minutes, not knowing how far he may or may not be. And he's like, uh, actually, oh, by the way, before that, before I tell you what he says, on his post, he said, you know, the item, the price. And he <clears throat> said, no holds, right? Mm-hmm. So I'm thinking this guy bailed yeah, on him, yeah, so yeah. he's pissed about the holding. Yeah. So he's like, uh, no, actually, I'm going to hold it till 5, uh, but I'll let you know then. And I'm like, till fucking 5? That's half a day away. What the fuck? Why would you repost it? And then put no holds. Now I'm so pissed about the crock nuts that I'm that you know usually I you know I'm diplomatic about yeah. shit, if I, especially if I want to get it for the price that, I, that, that that's there. But I'm literally like, who does this? Who just reposts it and says, nah, I'm holding it for some asshole. P.S. No holds on my post. Yeah. So I'm like, guy, I got the money right now on hand. I will be there. Stat. And he's like, no, no, I got you at five. If, if he, I was like, oh, all right, fine, fine. This group is known for coddling each other's nuts, mm-hmm. you know. And if you're like kind of an outsider, they they, they treat you as a second, a third, fourth, fiftieth class citizen. So I'm like, that's what I'm getting here. All right, fine, whatever. Five comes and goes, and it's a no go. I'm like, well, that's a bust. Today in the morning, get up from my slumber again, quote unquote, another night of restless sleep, and. Uh, you know, I fucking, I, I'm like, uh, there, there, there's nothing that should be coming in this day that will surprise me. But bing, I get that little bing. It's like if it, if it knew I was coming. And I was like, oh, it's that guy. And the little bitch is like, hey, man, it's all yours if you want it. And I'm like, oh, little motherfucker left you high and dry, huh? So I says to him, I says, cool, I'll be there. Oh, I'm sorry. I said, cool, where are you? And he thankfully was on our side of town. So I was like, I'll be there like in 30 minutes. I could get there like in 30 minutes. And he's like, can you come at 1030? What the fuck? Now you got to make me wait like four fucking yeah, hours? Yeah, come on, guy. And I was like, all right, fine. As long as I get it, you know, whatever. And then uh, not even 30 minutes pass. And he's like, hey, homie, uh, I'm good right now. If you want to go in 30 minutes, I'm like, Psh. I said, look, man, that's cool. But you got to drop me at least a fiver, man. Yeah. I'm driving 35 minutes out. And, and you'd be sucking ass for like three days straight. And you'd be sucking straight. ass. So, so, so he's like, yeah, yeah, all right, man. Cool. So I drive my way out there. Of course, I'm like on a 30-minute limit here, but by my own fault, mind you. And, of course, every obstacle on the fucking planet gets in my way. Trains, planes, possibly automobiles. And, of course, John Candy and Steve Martin in the mix. Yeah, they're corpses. Oh, wait, it's Steve Martin's still Damn, why Steve Martin dead? So I'm like, man, shit. So about, I'm, ten, I'm like running 10 minutes late. And he's like, hey, I'm I'm over here. We're supposed to meet at a gas station. I'm over here at Pump 10. And I'm like, uh, I'm like 10 minutes away. And he's like, are you not going to flake on me, are you? I'm like, oh, I got pissed, guy. So I sent him a little voice message. I said, I said, look, man, I'm not that motherfucker that you fucking threw me off the side with. I got the money. I'll be right there. Just chill. And he's like, oh, shit. <laughs> I was surprised he didn't just split. He was mm-hmm. like, oh, shit. Sorry, man. I'm just, I just, I didn't want to get burned. I was like, bitch, you already got burned. Anyway. I fucking slide up into his. Nope. <laughs> I drive. I drive up. Uh, up behind him. He's at a pump, yeah. and I'm like, "You still at pump ten? And he's like, "Yeah." And I'm like, "Cool. I'm right behind you, bitch." So he gets down and shit, looking like Sub Zero. By Sub Zero, I mean fat and old. Yeah. <laughs> so <laughs> not like Sub Zero at all. Sub Zero. And he hands me this boy, and I'm like, "Here's your stupid money." the fuck out of my face bitch <laughs> I, I didn't say that part but but i was thinking it for damn sure yeah. and he's like hey man i'm sorry bro you know i didn't mean i was like hey in fact you know what i'm sorry for losing my patience right now i'm just like fuck i got this shit in my hand that's it the deal's done yeah i'm out you know i said i said i'm sorry man i didn't mean to lose my patience but i i saw this it's my brother's birthday I had to get this shit. And he's like, all right, man. Cool, cool. Happy birthday to your brother. So happy birthday from Fat Sub-Zero. Mm, Fat Zero? And uh, so, yeah. All that to get you this. 
You're gonna fucking flip, guy. Mm-hmm. You're gonna flip. I feel like you built it up too much, guy. Nah, boy. This is like a two hundred plus dollar thing. For, I, didn't, I didn't get it for that for at 30, all, 35? boy. Thirty-five. Thirty-five, boy. That's a pretty good deal. <laughs> Ready? What is that? I you're hated going, that. Here you go, boy. Big ass <laughs> box. Oh hell yeah! yeah hold it in the middle. Bob. I can't reach, so your mega long has in the way. We got mad bubble. That's it. That's pretty good. Two thirty-five. Is this how he gave it to you? No, this is how I got it, boy. Oh. Wait, what? Is this is how you got it? No, this is how I put it in here. Oh, yeah, man. It's right here. I can't see. Ah. Oh shit, guy. Yeah, this is a good as 35? 35 guy. Now for those are going, that fucking sucks. Evil Learny. <laughs> First of all, you're a big Iron yeah, Maiden I'm, fan. Yeah, I'm a Maidite. I'm currently trying to get some Maiden stuff. This is an and 18 this, inch Eddie. This mad expensive everywhere. From uh, Art Asylum. Yeah, that's like the uh, like the Rob Zombie they made, right? Yeah, let me get it in there closer. Somehow. I gotta say, it's mad big. I, I didn't see the face right now, but I gotta say that it actually looks way better in person. Cause I had see, remember we saw it online and yep. we were kind of weird about the hair, cause it's like rooted hair. It actually looks pretty good, the hair. Let me see. Yeah, it looks. That doesn't look bad at all. Oh, it's got kind of crunchy. Yeah, it's got that that gel you're, head. You gonna have to Billy Eilish it like me. Yeah. But yeah, man, I was like, holy shit, this motherfucker got this shit. Doesn't even know he could sell it out of box for over 100 bucks. Yeah, no shit. Now, he didn't have the devil guy. Oh, it came with it? I didn't even know it came with it. But, uh, you know, shit, man. Yeah, Where else are you going to get that for that yeah, much? Man, that's pretty good, guy. I'm not even going to lie. Does it Does it speak? Uh, I have no fucking clue. <laughs> I don't think so. He's very bony, so. Nah, it doesn't seem to. Yeah, the... And the Rob Zombie one I had from the same brand had... Yeah, it spoke. Uh, spoke. Or sang, I guess. That was a cool one, too. Yep. He had that one, too, but I only, oh, had, yeah? I only had that fucking bucks. Coincidentally, the exact amount of bucks. Really, if I had had the sufficient amount of money, he had a lot of other stuff. Mm. If I had... He was selling all of it for 200 bucks total. But separate, it would be more, right? Yeah. I would have bought all that stuff in an instant because I, I could have kept some of it what's the other, and the other stuff i could have easily turned a profit on it what was the other it was an 18 inch scar head uh scarface scarhead oh yeah those are expensive uh, 18 inch scarface uh the 12 inch leonidas from 300 which i would have kept the rob zombie which i might have kept and uh this yeah that's a pretty good deal guy so each one of those can go easily over 100 bucks in, the, in some cases 200 bucks I actually was I considered getting this on ebay like a year ago i think or a little under a year ago and it was broken because it was it was like I think sixty bucks or something. And that was a good deal. Yeah. So one that's not broken for that much. It's sedan. a big boy. And it's a big boy and it's, oh man, he's not gonna fit in my Iron Maiden collection area. That's hey, right. Guys. Uh, how are you doing? Dude, that's I good. Know his voice. That would suck ass. I'm not gonna lie. Um I feel like I gotta I gotta step up the birthday game now, cause you got two badass. I felt that I, I felt that one. What, was it like a freaking comeback from that from that for the fucking Chinese? Chinese. <laughs> Which, by the way, I wasn't. That wasn't even a gift. That was just like a food thing. Yeah, and that sucked. Yeah, but no, no. I, well, well, one. I saw this. I was like, I have to get him that. I already have plans. Every year, I try to get you something cool. Yeah, I already had. And, well, I'll tell you what the other thing it was, was. The Red Hulk. It I, was know a, I know you've tried to get the Red. It Hulk. was the Red Hulk one, and another one was, and this one I could still get, but when this came up as an mm. option, I wasn't. I was actually considering getting that if nothing else came up. Uh, it was uh, kind of like this resin Eddie face mm. from uh, Book of Souls. That's actually pretty fucking cool. Mm. But then this came up, I was like, ah oh, hell, yeah, I'll just get on, this. Man. But um. Yes, yeah, so it was the Red Hulk. That dude kept flaking on me. Like, what is this guy? Yeah, I've been trying to get Red Hulk. I posted on some group recently that I was looking, or not looking for, but someone posted and I was like, oh, I've never been able to find one. And some Sandeep looking ass uh, messaged me if I wanted it. Mm-hmm. And I was like, nah, I don't trust this guy. Or you're like, 
Uh, is it from India? Because if yeah, it is, I don't want it. Yeah, homie looked like he was going to ask for some dick pics. Some dick pics afterwards. Some vagina bobs. He had the mad uh, porno mustache. Uh, guys, you got Indian guys. You got to stop with the mustache. Guys. Yes. Unless you're, unless you're a, a fucking, uh, what's his name? Uh, Sandeep. No, not Sandeep, man. Fucking, uh, uh, what's his name? Fucking, uh, ah, from the movie, man. Oh, uh, Singham. Singham. Unless you're Singham, don't wear a fucking mustache. It doesn't look good. Yeah, that's true. Anyway, that's your fucking birthday present, bitch. Damn, homie. <laughs> I was going to wait, but I was like, nah, boy. So what do you think, eh? Nah, it's pretty on fleek. Gonna One out of ten. Ten out of ten. I actually gave you a little, a little, uh, a little shout out on my, on my upcoming vid. Oh, yeah? I think you're all good now? Shouting people out in well, vids? Nah, homie, I was like, it came, the time came to show the white stripes down. I was like, this is pretty rad, guy. But here's the thing that y'all, oh, this is weird. This is how his leg's supposed to go if you line up the molding. What the fuck? Um, if y'all don't know about me, I have a, like, a zero ability to show any emotion in person. Uh, so I'm always just kind of like, cool. Uh, I feel like this was a move. Because you know that I open up more on these for some reason. Well, a definite move. Yeah. I was like, this guy fucking licks my nards. I hate it. Damn, I'm homie. i buy this fucking thing. I don't suck on nards. It's a pretty big nard. Damn, those are some fucking shaggy two dope feet. Yeah, homie got the county toes. Anyway, uh, so this was a fucking video that we did. So you almost right? murdered someone? Well, no, I want to kill that guy. But what? <laughs> who... <laughs> Who I almost did murder actually happened on the way back, but oh. that's for another video. Uh, let us know what you think about this gift, which I know to a lot of people means nothing at all. Yeah. But you don't understand his love of Eddie. One, two, the fucking price that this thing goes for. Yeah, this is pretty expensive. Dude. Um, and the man and just deal? the you know just finding one in the wild really. Yeah, especially in this area, dude. You can find them online, but you're gonna pay out the ass to get them. So anyway, there you go, guys. Thank you for joining us for this one. Stay tuned for the person i did almost kill video Damn, and all man. kinds of other fucking nonsense that we do here on this channel uh because we're out